good guys welcome back to day 23 so we have two more days of Stephmas, and then that is it your girl's taking a break till january 1st <laughs> but no i'm really excited guys that we have successfully gotten to this point so today we are going to be focusing on another missing person case today we are talking about 19 year old taman mary jones um Miss Jones went missing on April 18th of 2002. She has not been seen since, guys. She also has a she also had a 2-year-old daughter at the time of her disappearance. Jones was last seen in the Penn Grove, New Jersey area. She was at her apartment the last time anyone had ever seen her. She was so called to be on the phone roughly about 1 a.m. that that night. When her brother did not hear from her, he got very concerned and went over to her apartment. When he got there, her front door was wide open and no one had seen or heard from her since. Foul play is suspected in this case. Authorities have stated. Her family states that she would not just leave because she left her purse, her keys, and she wouldn't leave her two-year-old daughter without telling any family. Anna said she was a dedicated mother, very enthused with being a mother, and that she would never abandon her child. Joan's parents believed that her child's father, Mark S. Goodson, is a suspect in the case because they have stated that Miss Jones met him when she was 15 years old. Also stated that she would she was in a shelter trying to basically get be away from him because he was abusive and he basically created so much drama in her life. Goodson was later in prison from a previous case. He was in prison for unrelated molestation and drug charges. But he does deny any involvement in this case with Miss Jones. But what's even crazier is that his ex-girlfriend's body was found naked. And and she was dumped in a... I want to make sure I'm reading that right. She was dumped in a Alloway Creek in New Jersey in 2000. That crime is unsolved. Authorities are not certain if it is related to Miss Jones' disappearance as well. But Goodson claims he is the prime suspect in both of those cases. He did search that creek after finding after finding out that information for Miss Jones, but nothing was turned up. Before Miss Jones' disappearance, she was studying for her GED and she was basically raising her daughter before she went missing and no one knows anything about it just case like all the other cases are truly sad you know people just don't disappear off the face of the earth and hopefully if her child's father did have anything to do with it he will come clean and say something so that the family can have some type of peace and or and or find out where her body is if she is deceased you know for this long, 2002, it's been a very long time, just like a lot of other cases that I have covered. And like I say all the time, no one just falls off the face of the earth. And hopefully one day someone will have the guts to just say something if they had seen anything. I mean, Lord, you know, it's like, that is pretty much Miss Jones' case. She is still missing. Again, she has been missing since April 18th of 2002. She was 19 years old at the time of her disappearance with a two-year-old daughter. Her family is raising her baby girl, and that's just even more sad. You know, you have to look at your grandchild, you know, your niece, and you just say, you know, we just want some type of answers. And I think that's pretty much all it is because I do believe from what I had read because like I always try to look on like social media too because a lot of groups create missing person cases, missing person groups, but I really couldn't even find anything at all. You know, maybe someone had any type of information pertaining to her, but that's why, again, it's so important that we talk about their cases and discuss it because hopefully somewhere someone's listening, someone's reading, watching, whatever, and they can see her picture maybe they may have seen her somewhere you know you just never know but guys i will see you in day 24 sending love and light to the jones family hopefully they will get some type of answers for their daughter